Coach Robotics Mentor is an adult and a professional that comes to help help our team out throughout the season and uh, off season. And they come and uh, work with the kids one on one and help us to succeed. Before I did first robotics, I didn't really know what I wanted to do. I thought I was probably going to major in business in school, and I really had no idea. But after I did robotics, I was like, yes, this is what I want to do. I want to be an engineer. Mentorships and apprenticeships are really fundamentally important ways for people to become productive. In first, it's so wonderful when you hear a kid say, you know, I'd never worked with anybody older than me and nobody ever allowed me to think I could do anything. And now I know, I know how to do these things. I have some faith in my own ability. Well, when I first started, robotics is my sophomore year the first year of the team I was pretty pretty much a wallflower didn't really want to talk too much but as the mentoring progressed I saw that these communication skills were essential to being successful just without them I would still be too shy to really do anything If you look at what FIRST is, it is a job too big, a time too short, a budget too small, and a team too large, with absolutely hard, unforgiving deadlines. So it is a fantastic way to learn product development in a powerful package. FIRST, I think, tries to make the competition hard enough that the students need help. They need to reach out and go and ask an engineer or a machinist or somebody that kind of is in that line of work to help them. One of the primary things that mentors do in this program is provide guidance. The kids build the, the robot. They develop the ideas uh, and then they actually fabricate the parts and assemble the robot. That way they own it and they come away with the pride of, uh, of what they accomplished. They're there to try and steer the students in the right direction, make sure that they don't um, come up with things that are too fanciful, too hard to do so that we can get it done in six weeks, but at the same time try and encourage them to be really creative, to think outside the box. If you look at the kinds of things that happen in a first team, it goes all the way from marketing and communication to programming, to fundraising, to electromechanical design, etc. It's all there. We need mentors that can help in all of those ways. This is a much bigger program than just building a robot. The kids put together a business plan. They enter competitions where they have to present their program to a panel of judges. They get involved in community outreach. All of those things are necessary for the program to be successful. And that's really what FIRST Robotics teaches people how to do, is how to you know, basically set up their own small business. And I think that's really special that you know, people you know, in high school are learning how to do things that people in industry do. Well, there's a lot of different reasons why I'm a mentor, but probably one of the main ones is to watch the students kind of have that enlightening moment, that light bulb kind of flick on in their head when they realize that this is what they really like to do. With FIRST, you really get the prolonged exposure to these kids that you wouldn't really get in other programs. You really are one-on-one, -on -one. you are teaching them life skills that they will forever be indebted to you. A mentorship is not just about sitting down and teaching a kid how to run a milling machine. It's teaching them how to think about a problem, how to think about their relationship with other team members, how to learn to be forgiving, how to make sure that you understand that when you walk out on the field and you meet another team that's going to be a member of your alliance, you know how to interview them and find out what their strengths and weaknesses are, figure out a plan to work with them. As a life skill, that's fantastic. Here's why a person should become a mentor. They're helping to shape the future. The youth are our future, and the only way to ensure that 
We have a future is to invest now in the youth. When businesses and employers see the kids coming out of the robotics program and they know that we're the future employees, I know that that's what they're going to be looking for. And we work with science and technology. We work in teams. And when they see that high schoolers are experiencing this, they, they want them and they want to be able to help them. And I think that's why engineers and marketing people come and help us because they know that we're going to be the future. We're going to be in their job someday. And they can help us out now and help us find what we're going to do. You can't really explain being a mentor for FIRST until you experience it firsthand, only because it's different than any other mentoring experience that you've ever been involved with. It's going to add energy to your life. It's going to reinvigorate your career. It's going to make you feel like a kid again, just being around the kids. If you talk to a FIRST student or a FIRST alumni like myself, they'll say, I had this great mentor that really pushed me in the right direction. I had this great team around me, this support group that really changed my life.